Hi my friends, so my name is Sarah and I'll start by singing a song with you. Can everyone clap their hands? Okay, so now that we can know you can clap your hands, you're going to need to clap during this song. Um, so let's start. Can you clap a friend's name with me, name with me? Let's clap Yara's name. Can you clap a friend's name with me, name with me? Let's clap Jonathan's name. Can you clap a friend's name with me, name with me? Let's clap Lisa's name. Okay, so now that we know each other and we've moved and we've singed a little bit, let's read a story. It's one of my favorites. It's called Grumpy Monkey. And can you guess what it's about? So yes, it is about being grumpy. Has anyone here felt grumpy before? Me too. So this book is about feeling grumpy and knowing that it's okay to feel grumpy sometimes. Okay, so let's find where we're going to start. Everyone wanted Jim to enjoy this wonderful day. They said, you should sing with us. Jim didn't feel like singing. You should swing with us, said the monkeys. Jim didn't feel like swinging. You should roll with us, said the zebras. Jim didn't feel like rolling. You should stroll with us, said the peacocks. Jim didn't feel like strolling. You should lie in the grass. You should stomp your feet. You should take a bath and make a splash. You should hug someone. You should laugh. You should take a nap. You should eat old meat or some honey. You should jump up and down. You should sit in the sun. But Jim didn't feel like doing any of that. Why are you grumpy? Asked the others. It's such a wonderful day. I'm not grumpy, shouted Jim. He beat on his chest and he stormed off. Jim felt sorry. A little sorry for shouting at everyone, but mostly sorry for himself. I guess I am grumpy, Jim sighed. And just as he was starting to feel really sad, he came upon Norman. Norman was slumped, his eyebrows were bunched, and he was frowning. What's the matter? Are you grumpy? asked Jim. No, I danced with porcupine, said Norman. Are you okay? asked Jim. It hurts, but I'll probably feel better soon, said Norman. Are you still grumpy? <clears throat> yeah, said Jim, but I'll probably feel better soon too. For now, I need to be grumpy. It's a wonderful day to be grumpy, said Norman. Jim sighed and he already felt a little better. The end. So I hope to see you guys soon. And for now, it's time to say bye.